fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. What? Holy shit. What's wrong? Holy shit! What's going on? I don't know. Okay. We're playing Back in Action. Good movie. How, how many Looney Tunes games is this into our series? Is it two? Is this, this is three. The this, this is the three. Oh, it's the third? Okay. We did um, really shitty da Duck Dodgers. Oh, God. Um, that was horrible. Very mediocre Porky Pig. Yeah. And now we are going into holy fucking long loading screen back in action. <laughs> yeah. So we screwed around a little in this game just to yeah, get just, the idea. Just a little like, bit. We are planning to make this a series, but like, you can tell by the part one at the beginning of this episode. If there's no part one and we just give up, then I apologize. But yeah. Oh. Soon the whole world is that? That's. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, it's been a long time since I've seen Back in Action, so. Oh, okay. I apologize, this shit is unfamiliar to me. That's fine. I was that, okay, was that a good movie? Cause... No, it was horrible. Alright, because I liked it as a kid, but I liked many things as a kid. I didn't even like it as a kid. Oh. I felt that it was an insult to Looney Tunes. Well, I also liked, liked Space Jam as a kid. Well, Space Jam's awesome, though. But a lot of people hate it. Who? I don't know anybody that hates it. Nostalgia critic? Okay, well, I don't know anybody that hates All right. it. <laughs> well, well, he railed it. Okay. Pretty hard. Oh, God. What is wrong, wrong with his with head? You want... I was going in a bad place there. I think that we both were. We should not insult the way that his head looks. He right, can't I'm, help it. I'm, I'm sorry, but... It, Even it, if it does look like an upside-down ice cream cone. <laughs> it's not our fault if his head melted. <laughs> We didn't cause it. We'll just leave it alone. He was, um, one of the guys that was, like, an actual actor in the movie, I think, right? I, th I, think, I think so. I remember something about, like, a jungle. Oh, hello. What? Holy shit. Okay, we can make fun of his melty head now. Yeah. It's just a costume. Yeah. We could, could we make fun of his, like, really defined jaw? Or forehead? He has more bones than a human head should have. Yeah. Like, he looks like, a um, like meat. <laughs> you know, like, that uh, meat that kind of has, like, that hourglass figure? Yeah. It looks like he has that shoved into his jaw. Oh, God. Plastic monkey with the top hat. That was pretty good. It was pretty good. Didn't even it. It broke right through the glass. Yeah. That was nice. Big diamond. Very good monkey. Didn't leave um a monkey imprint in the window though. I noticed that. Oh, that's that's. See, look, it's just just, just broken glass. Look. Come on. Nice jump, Daddy. Okay, so um. Why is Speedy a security guard? Because he can catch criminals! He's quick! But isn't his whole thing like, um, kind of almost being a criminal? Uh. Like, a lot of his, a lot of his cartoons were about breaking and entering. Yeah? Yeah. Or I assume crossing the border. Like, I don't know. He has, like, the ability to run fast, so he should be a cop, I guess. I, I gotta Maybe. say, oh, 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 oh nice. Oh, I, I, okay, I really love how there is. Oh no! Damn it, man! Oh, okay. Let me make my point. Okay, recuperating. I really love right. how there is a solid yellow line determining left and right lane, and these guys are just driving wherever the fuck they please. <laughs> well, they need to get places. <laughs> don't don't like, argue with their I mean, fucking logic, man. Even Frogger was more, like, even Frogger was more consistent than that. Yeah. I believe so. It's been a long time since I froggered. I don't. I don't think so. Oh, well, at least at least one edition was. One, one out from. of the billion. I don't know. That is inaccurate to speedy speediness. He could just catch this thing. Ooh, why, like, why am I the one that has to do it? Well, why are you oh, the well, one we, that they're chasing? We can't put this on the channel now. Monkey abuse. Oh, I'm sorry. Peter's gonna get on her ass. Yeah. Even though I'm an animal. You know, I, I I can't do it. Has PETA attacked Arthur? I don't know. Because it's like... An, also also fucking uh, Mickey Mouse. One of those things where there's... um, Where all the characters are anthropomorphic animals, but they have a pet who's a regular animal. Oh, yeah. That always bothers me. It's so odd. Like, doesn't it just become slavery then? I, I guess. Or is it kind of like... um? 
like the unevolved version of the same creature. Yeah, it's kind of like if we... Oh. oh. Never, never mind. <laughs> we, we do own monkeys, if that's what you're going to say. Oh, sure. Monkeys, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's uh, totally what I was going to say. Oh, you're talking about slavery. Maybe. Yeah, because so was I. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> like, I, I mean, like, that the face. animal... With only the animal is a form of slavery. Why is Bug such a smug cocksucker? I don't know. Like, this is gonna be a thing, isn't it? Yeah, this is gonna be a thing. Enjoy saving and loading. Oh my Christ! Like, it is all that is completely on the developers. Yeah, there are ways to make that better. They did it in Tony Hawk. Remember, it was so innovative, right? <laughs> I actually forget. You don't remember? They oh, are you talking about American Wasteland? Yeah, they brought out oh, yeah. American Wasteland. They were advertising it as no loading screens. There were still loading screens. They were screens. totally loading screens. <laughs> it just means um, th th that was a smart game. Just um, it could have they could have made, made it smarter. Oh, like the thing is, there's no loading screens if you're walking oh, start to finish. There totally are loading screens if you decide to warp somewhere. Damn it! Nice. I was I was so close to the finish there. You were doing much better at this in the um, in our little demo. Oh. It's also, okay, that car it. was totally like over the line. Yeah. Like, I thought Brampton drivers were bad. I guess LA is even worse. Brampton's horrible. Brampton is terrible. They brought up the insurance rates in Brampton, which is an area in Canada for you American audience watching us. Uh. Worst insurance in all of Canada. It is is in Brampton because of the drivers. So what do you And then it also has Ooh, like oh, the um, highest rate of uninsured drivers. <laughs> but that's completely understandable. It also has the highest rate of fucking terrible douchebag drivers too though. Yeah. It is so bad. I can't do it. Seriously, like when I, back at my old job, getting to work was pretty much a straight line down one street, and that was the most dangerous drive I've done. And I had to do it like four times a week. Going to your work? Yeah, like just driving up Queen Street. Oh God, what so the hell? So I, I missed that. I was looking away. What happened? The the camera was just really fucky. That's good. So, oh. so why, why does Bugs need all this money? Um, like he's got by without money before. Why does he need it now? Well, the idea is that they need money to get onto a plane, but they don't know that yet. Oh, so you're just... Oh, now you're the meta one. Yeah. Good job. So, yeah, I, I should really re-watch this movie, because, like, like I said, I remember liking it. But... Look at that dead stare in his face. Look at that fucking croissant-shaped beak. That was odd. Yeah, well, like it looked like fat and puffy. All, all that they, out. yeah, all that they're doing is just stretching out their face, <laughs> making them talk that way. They aren't actually like programming it. It's like feeding a dog peanut butter. Yeah, I always wanted to do that. I did that. I, I never did that because I never owned a dog. Well, not true. I owned a dog for like three months, but we had to give it away. I involuntarily owned a dog once, or and I still do. Yeah, you have a dog. It barks a lot. It does. Like, a lot. <laughs> well, it stopped barking at me now. That's it knows good. I'm not a stranger. Yeah. Except sometimes it still barks at me and I'm like, what the fuck, just stop it. <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure that she, like, has really horrible eyesight. Hmm. That's just me, though. Your mom still occasionally seems to suspect that I'm scared of her, but, but I'm not. That's good. Like, I, I realize she will not bite me. Ah! Most dogs like that are just babies. They wouldn't hurt a thing. Except Look at this for parkour. most things. Look at this parkour. Nice. Can you get out of the level like that? No. Or they have an invisible wall. There's, uh... Ah, damn it. Yeah, That's invisible bold. wall. Looks like you could. I can go over here. I know that there's things <laughs> over here. Seems like it. Got some nice old cash. Frog. Is there a, like, fucking... Yeah. Oh. oh, nice job. Good one there. It's okay, I need to go over here anyways, I'm pretty sure. Right. Uh, Where are the rest of these... Oh yeah, there was one, like, uh, over there on top of these buildings. Don't get spotted by the cops. Uh, 
Do you just, like, steal money out of that crate by jumping on top of it? Yeah. Is that a thing that happens? I don't know. Okay. Well, I guess so. Well, it, it just happened. happened, so... Here we go. I won't question it. Parkour. What is going on? Parkour. Good job. Yeah. Parkour your way all up to a fucking wanted poster. First of all, this is giving me some Assassin's Creed flashbacks. Second of all, just like Assassin's Creed, why are the cops putting wanted posters that are supposed to inform the public in places the public cannot see? Oh yeah. I didn't even think of that. Like, what is with that shit? Like, that pissed me off all the time in Assassin's Creed, where they have a wanted poster to warn the public against a dangerous man who was an expert at free running, only accessible by a person who is an expert at free running. <laughs> like, what the hell is that? I mean, this one you can see, though. Yeah, but there still are others that were a little bit oddly hidden. Maybe it's for people that are, like, in planes or something. Oh, that that makes sense. Like, you oh. know those low-hanging oh, no. plans? Oh, Jesus, uh, what is he doing to you? I'm, I'm so used to playing Dead Rising 3. I just, like, whenever I see that escape thing, I always, uh... Yes, right, you get fucked. I, I always shake my controller. Just have to do that. Oh, fuck. Like, that would bother me. <laughs> eh. What is the worst motion-controlled game you've ever played? Worst? Uh, like, not, e not even worse, just, um, most fucking annoying. <sighs> like, if, if it works, it's fine. It's just, like, if it's so uncomfortable and awkward. Motion control like, cause game. Like, there are excellent yeah. ones, like, um, Pikmin 2 and 3. There are ones where it, um, the motion control doesn't need to be purely accurate. Like, Super Mario Galaxy where it's good. But, um... Okay, one that is terrible in a great game yeah. is um, Ratchet and Clank, um, Tools of Destruction. Okay. You know how um, the PS3, um, what, what's it called? Not DualShock 3, um, 6-axis controller? It had like the kind of tilt thing that they were advertising for like flight simulator games at the beginning of, its, of the PS3's life cycle? Yeah. Ratchet and Clank decided to try that, and it is so uncomfortable. Like, you're controlling this laser and tracing a pattern. If you're using, like, the PS Move or Wiimote, it's easy, because you're pointing at it. You are, like, tracing a line. You're using the fucking six-axis. You are tilting a weirdly shaped controller, trying to angle a laser. <laughs> like, you aren't even, like, moving it. You are tilting it. Yeah. It is impossible to control, and, like, one of the most uncomfortable things ever. Oh, there's the last one. Other than that, it's a fantastic game, though. How did I miss this one? This is... Well, I mean, it's like... Pretty close to where I started. Yeah, I guess you just didn't look that way. Well, poster's destroyed. Poster's destroyed, Daffy Duck saved, and like... Did he just bury himself back in there, like, when you saved him? Well, yeah, because he still wanted, so he's like, Oh, shit! And then he jumped back into the thing. So he's just, like, presenting his booty? Yeah. Little kicky legs. Man, go. Porky and Speedy are very incompetent security guards. Also, why are Porky and Speedy security guards? Well, was that in the movie? Ah, uh, fuck, I forget. We really should have marathoned. Well, not marathoned, just one movie. We really should have watched Back <laughs> in Action before we started this. Marathon in one movie. Marathon one movie six times. Oh, that is abuse. Yeah, do you think we're gonna get, like, charged for. Well, definitely. Yeah? yeah? That's how it happens. Like, even things that don't have animal abuse in them get charged for animal abuse. Yeah. Like, fucking Super Mario 3D Land was great. <coughs> yeah. Have you fucking played that, um, like, PETA game they made for it? No. It's kind of stupid and funny. It's just like a fucking, like, free run game. Like, you just have to jump and avoid the obstacles while you're like a skinless tanuki running after a bloody Mario wearing your skin. Yeah. It's so over the top and stupid that it just it's just funny. Like based on that, do you think that PETA crashes furry conventions? Maybe. I would love to see that. Maybe. <laughs> like, if that is on YouTube, somebody please link that to us. Okay, so how much money do I need? This is where I need to collect money in order to get to Paris because that monkey that stole the diamond. That was just simply able to run across the fucking ocean is now in Paris, and we what? need to go and t get a plane ticket there. What is Daffy's intention? Does like does he want the diamond for some like extra meaning, or does he just want it for its monetary value? 
Yeah. It's Daffy Duck. Who do you think? But you are collecting money to get to Paris and spending all this money to get this diamond that you don't know the value of. Eh. Money is everywhere. I they, don't think they it's might, an option. They might know the value, though. Well, was that established? I wasn't fucking listening. It might have been established. Why would yeah. I be? I'm pretty sure it was established. Oh my god, these loading screens. It's okay, we get a cool monkey. Look at him, he's like... It's just mouth, like, popped open. Yet weirdly closed when it's, like, on the sides. You see... You see oh, or was no. that his nose? I couldn't tell. No, that, that was his nose. This game is strange. Alright, so now... It does want me to... Does it make me want to play Gex? Now to go and do bullshit. That sounds like fun. Just collect some dough. Yeah. Get your swag on. Uh, I think. Are you just avoiding the swag? Well, cause there's like, I don't, I don't need to go and get all of the cash that's around me, cause there's more cash in other areas. Yeah, but like every little bit counts and adds up. Like I don't even know how much I need. I just get all. Um, some really easy cash right there. Fifteen dollars. I wish it was that easy. You know, I'm a lot It'd be nice. Yeah. Than you want, then we wouldn't have to do bullshit like be upstanding citizens. Yeah, that would suck. And like have jobs. Like, ugh. yeah, I wish. We can just run around and dig holes. That'd be great. Let's do that. Checkpoint. Make my day. Oh, fuck. oh no. God, uh, Elmer, like, what happened to your God cheeks? Do you get old? Were they always that droopy? Yeah. He's got, like, droopy dog droopiness. Also, droopy dog has, like, one of my favorite voices in cartoon history. Droopy dog? Yeah. That's so great. Have a nice day, sir. <laughs> your floor, sir. I love it. It's so good. I'm sure I'm bad at it, but it's so good. I mean, no. of course I'm bad at it. I'm, I'm, I'm not a good person that much. Okay, fucking... There we go. And... Talking the glory, rabbit. Oh. Okay, so is this like... Oh, um, come on. Oh, it's this kind of swapping, where you have to... um, You have them in two completely separate areas. Yeah. It works in strategy games like Pikmin, but... um, And a platformer just seems uh -oh. annoying. Yeah, because you have to do the same thing twice. Hmm. Like in Pikmin 2, you have to like bring them to different areas to do things like much faster. And this, it just makes it slower. Wait, what? He can't, like, he's not a rabbit. He can't burrow. Can you roll? Uh, Can that make it through? Or do you have to like go around another way? I guess I have to go around another way. Yeah, probably. Like, he can't double jump, but he can glide, right? Yeah, it looks like it. So, can you get up the thing over there? Like, oh, that. Down there. Oh, shit. Maybe. You think that guy could, sl could have slowed down just a little? He was actually going really slow. Yeah, but, like, you were right in his way. He could have hit you. Yeah. That would have been mean. Like, does uh, this even lead around? Like, like what happened? Fuck. Oh. Oh. That's good. That box is your ticket up. Maybe I need to do um, something with Bugs Bunny. Maybe you can like open the gate from the other side. That's what I was thinking. Like, I hope so. What's Foghorn Leghorn doing? Is he wearing a sweater? Yes, he's totally wearing a sweater. Why? Oh, I can chat with him. Oh yeah. Monkey for sale at a thousand dollars. You want to buy the monkey? No. Oh. What does the monkey do? I have no clue. Is I don't just know. Just a collectible? What, I don't know what any of these do. Yeah, let's just get through this game and, like, if we beat the final boss, we're done. Who cares? So, I don't even remember what the final boss is or if there is one. It's probably Brendan Fraser. <laughs> Speaking Brendan of which, Fraser. does they li license him for this game? I don't is think Brendan so. Is Brendan Fraser in this game? I don't think so. Bullshit! Now I have to take him out of the thumbnail. No, that's fine. Leave Except him. No, leave, he, leave he's him. staying there. Leave him. It's okay. Uh, you know the weird thing I found about Brendan Fraser? What? I hate him as an actor. He's bad. Yeah. Yet I don't hate his movies. Yeah. How does he do that? <laughs> He's like Nicolas Cage. <laughs> well, Nicolas Cage you love for his ridiculousness. Um, Brendan Fraser is just lame. Yeah. Like, there's not much going on with him. Okay, I, I don't fucking know what to do. 
Um, I don't know what to do. Just, well, just whip, whip back to Daffy. Okay. And on the next episode, Chris will figure out what to do. Yeah, no, I want to do it now, though. You, you want to figure out what to do? I want to do it now. But what if we waste our time? Oh, I thought that, that was just another leaves. game. Damn it. I want to do it now, though. Nope. Okay, I'll, I'll let you try. Maybe you can jump over the boxes over there. Uh, like, you have to get over this fence. Wee! <laughs> that's, that's pretty good. Um, that's right, get fucked. What? 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 I own the shit out of him. Seriously, um, oh. There we he's go. Dead. <laughs> now he's dead, dead. <laughs> oh, shit. You fucking murderer. Uh, so he can glide a little. Does that help you at all? Like, not really, because there's nothing... And you can't just roll under it? What's I can, like... Like... Oh, oh! Try... Bounce off the cars. What's up, Dad? Talk to Granny. What's up, Granny? Do you have the key for something? Keep your shirt on, Granny. You, can you turn on subtitles? I don't know. Um, try bouncing on the car. Just, like, jump on it several times. It doesn't trampoline? No. Damn it. That was my idea. Well... I guess next time you figure out what to do. Yep. Fuck it. <laughs> See ya! Oh! I did it. What?! I did it. I fucking did it. <laughs> what the fuck? I wish a car would just come and kill me.